Hey friend, are you asking, does YouTube still work? Can you still make money on YouTube? Hey, my name is Chris from ChrisandGia.com and it is an exciting episode today. I'm gonna, we're gonna answer the question, how does YouTube work to make money, all right? And we're gonna do this by going over the three secrets that I learned from watching a recent video that uh, Pat Flynn put up, AKA the Smart Passive Income Guy, did with uh, MKBHD, Marcus Brownlee, the tech guy, and the sequence that I learned that made me realize that, oh my God, yes, you can definitely still make YouTube work and make money with it if you know a few tips and tricks that I don't know a lot of people realize that can definitely save your business. So hey, stick around for that if you want to learn exactly those three secrets, all right? So stick around for that. So hey, welcome. Hey, if you don't know, this channel is all about empowering you, all right? The home business entrepreneur with the mindset and the marketing skill sets to get results, start making more money, and finally hit the breakthrough that you deserve, all right? So if you like that kind of content, you jive with that, hey, consider giving this video a like, consider subscribing to the channel, and don't forget the bell too so you can be notified when I drop new videos, all right? Especially on like, how does YouTube work or YouTube making money online, which is pretty much on a daily basis, Monday through Friday right now. All right, so let's get right down into it, all right? I recently watched a video from Pat Flynn. If you don't know him, he has a website called smartpassiveincome.com. All right. He also has a YouTube channel. I call him the Smart Passive Sage because he's been doing this for a while, sharing valuable content on exactly how you can make passive income online. So he did this interview with Marcus Brownlee. If you don't know him, he's also a very successful YouTuber as well. Been on the, been in the game and he does a lot of tech reviews, very successful, over almost 8 million subscribers. And I thought it was pretty interesting what he shared, what these two guys talked about in terms of how YouTube works and how he got his start. And so I just wanted to share three, three things, secrets from my opinion, that I learned from listening to this interview, watching this video, that I think about might be helpful because if, if you're asking yourself, hey, how does YouTube work? Can you really make money with it? Hey, how do these guys get to the level that they've got? Hey, I'm a small YouTuber just like you if you're watching this. So I got a whole lot of value from this and I think you might well, might as well, might too. So here we go. All right. So the first secret I learned from on when they talks about talking about how does YouTube work was that you got to keep making the videos. You just got to keep making the videos. You see, when I listened to the interview, Marcus Brownlee, actually, even though the man has almost 7.6 million subscribers right now, the guy started off just like the rest of us. Probably, I think he said about 10 years ago, making videos that nobody was watching. He had less than 100 subscribers at the time when he was doing it, and we get little to no views. But yet, despite that, he was making consistent amount of videos. As a matter of fact, I think I heard he said he had 100 subscribers, and he did like 100 plus videos for less than 100 subscribers, right? So are you making videos like that? If you're a small channel, are you consistently making videos, right? Because I think, I believe that that's the key in when you talk about how YouTube works. I've noticed and also heard that YouTube right now is such such a massive channel uh, platform right now. It really is. They get, they get literally billions of views every single day. Okay, they are the number two search engine on the planet. Over 400 hours of YouTube video is uploaded to the platform every minute. Okay, so think about that. The YouTube is, qu is quite crowded. What is YouTube doing in order to see who's really serious about their channel? They're looking at people who are uploading content regularly. I truly believe that if you're uploading videos almost daily, especially when you're in a beginner, that is what sets you apart and lets you and helps YouTube see you and help you out. So I really truly believe that even though you're small, that's actually the point where you should be cranking out videos like crazy, if at all possible on a daily basis. But if not, at least consistently three plus videos every single week. My right, second secret that I learned from this interview between Pat Flynn and Marcus Brownlee on how YouTube works, this the second thing I learned was that, well it's kind of a combination, is that you kind of you got to keep doing the videos and you got to strategically do the right videos. You see, he actually kept on doing videos for a while until he was able to get to this point where he did this one video that got him well over 
thousands of views in like under 24 hours, where typically he was only getting like maybe a dozen plus views, right? And so he looked at it and was like, what? How did I end up getting a thousand views? It was because he did a video on like something that people were searching for and people, when they found it, they were watching it, watching it and watching it. And so what I get from that is two things. One is that this process of creating videos, you kind of have to keep on going with it until you can figure it out. And that's what, it's what I like to call, it's kind of like, I call it the baking point, all right? Because if you think about it, how long does it take for a baby to like get made, right? Nine months, right? Let's say you really, really want this baby like faster. Is there anything you can do to get this baby to come to you faster than nine months? No, <laughs> right? Like it doesn't matter how badly you want it, how hungry and desperate you are for a baby, what you're willing to do, it don't matter. You still got to wait, right? Because nature has its own timetable on things, right? There's just certain things that have a natural timetable on it. There's no matter what you do, it's going to take nine months to bake. And so I call this certain things like this, I, there's like a, what I call a baking time in it, right? Nature's baking time. And when you put the bread in there, it's going to be, it's going to be like nothing, right? Nothing, nothing, nothing until at a certain point and all of a sudden it starts rising and poof, 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 right? And so that's kind of what it is when it comes to YouTube. When I think about how does YouTube work, especially when you're trying to make money, it's all about sticking with it. It's like sticking with it until you figure things out. And when you figure it out, boom, that's the point where it starts to swell up, right? The baby is ready, right? You've got the you've got the 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 product of the fruit of your labor right there, right? And the second thing kind of in it that I learned is that hey, YouTube is a search engine. We just talked about it. it's the number two search engine on the planet, right? That means that you really, when you're creating content, if you can serve people based on the questions that they're asking with search with search terms, you actually make it easier on yourself. Like right? it's, it's it's approaching your your videos and your channel and your business in a very strategic way. Like hey, not just creating random videos, which is okay in the beginning. But eventually, right, you get to this baking point where you start to realize, oh, I need to really start focusing on creating content that people are actually looking for and ask, asking questions about. That's going to help you take your success long term. It's going to take it up to that next level. And that is key, key strategy if you're trying to make money on YouTube. And the third thing that I learned about how YouTube works from listening to this interview between Pat Flynn and Marcus Brownlee is that you got to think about your quality, being of quality and having a stand on something. So he talked about how, you know, the right now he's the man's got over 7.6 million subscribers. People are always reaching out to him to, hey, hey, check out my product. Check this out. Check this out. And what he said was that he don't just do reviews on just anything. Right. He's got to check out the product actually use the product, right? <laughs> and then if he likes it, then he does an interview, then he does a review, then he does a video, right? And so what that makes me think is that if you're trying to make money with YouTube, the way it works is that it is a social search engine, meaning people are looking at this, meaning that they're going to know whether or not your content is of quality. And it all is all about bringing value to the marketplace quality value. If you look at the man's headline, it's all about quality tech videos, right? I mean, that's what it's all about. Quality, being of quality, being of value to people and helping people because people are going to know when your stuff is not right, when it's not fresh, it's not clean. You know, you didn't put your energy in it. You didn't give your all in it. People just know. There's just a feeling that people get. And when the people get that, you lose people. And so, if you look, I'm think you look at how he's he set up his entire channel. It's all about quality, putting valuable content in this case tech tech review videos that are helpful. That he knows that if he was watching this, he would get value from it, right? And that's the whole idea. And then uh, at the same time, he doesn't just represent any company or any product that he gets. It's got to be something that he knows works. And so when you're doing, when we're talking about how YouTube works, 
And especially if you're trying to make money, your content has to be quality and on point and just represent you. And you got to be talking about products. So let's say you're doing product reviews, you're doing affiliate marketing, network marketing, you're making, you're selling products. It's got to be stuff that you use, that you represent, that you like, that you know and trust. And it's, you're all over it because it makes a difference when you come through in the message that you're sharing with your audience. And it's a big deal in terms of generating that trust and building that rapport and authority and leadership with your audience. So that's it, my friend. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that was helpful, man. That was extremely helpful for me when I viewed that. And it made me think, hey, you know what? We're on our way. You know, we're on our way. If you're a small YouTuber and you're thinking, oh, my God, I can never be as big as them. Let me give you, give you an extra bonus that I learned. Hey, these guys started small, too. They started small and they kept on with the kept on. They just had passion and love for what they're doing, which carried them through the grind, through the eight, nine months where you don't see results. You see what I'm saying? And I'm not going to say that it's going to take you nine months. It could be longer, right? But the point of the matter is that they stuck with it because they had a love for what they're doing and they kept on with it. They didn't worry about other big players at the time. They just kept focusing. I think that's a great message that I think is helpful. And trust me, you can do this. I believe in you. If you watch this video all the way through the end, I believe that you have what it takes and you have the fire and the goal and the mm, to go after it. So, hey, do it. All right. I believe in you. You can do it. So hope the video was helpful. Hope it was valuable. If you did, hey, definitely give the video a like. Consider subscribing to the channel for more content like this. Oh, and definitely check out Marcus Brownlee's channel. All right. And the smart passive income sage himself, Pat Glenn. Check out that channel. I follow them both. Great, great quality content there, and um, definitely appreciate them for like sharing their valuable content and helping us small YouTubers like us. And oh, by the way, hey, if you want to know what I use, my number one recommended tool to have an advantage on YouTube and make quality videos that rank and make me money, then yeah, you might want to check out VidIQ, all right? Great tool. I use it. Check out the free trial on the link below, all right? And that's it, my friend. Until the next exciting episode, be blessed. Stay hungry out there. I'll see you on the next one, all right? Peace.